Hey there, welcome to Jabs, just another board game show. And on this episode, we're going to play Cascadia, designed by Randy Flynn, illustrated by Beth Sobel, and published by Flatout Games and AEG. And a disclaimer, I will make mistakes during this play. <laughs> And hey there, let's get to some uh, Cascadia. So I'll set you up for what's going on here. I'm currently uh, in the process of playing their uh, achievement scenarios, and I'm on achievement number nine, and I'll see if I can get you a little look here. Little little look-see. So achievement number nine, that means I need to make 90 points, 10 points in all of these animals, 5 points for the re- every region, and these are the um, cards that come out. So I'll quickly show you these cards. So the first one is the red fox, and the red fox scores me points. Let me just read it for you. Scores for each fox um, uh, a number of unique different animals pairs that are adjacent to it. And then we have the grizzly bear and uh, scores per group of bears with no other bears next to it. And let me get a good picture of that one. So two, five, and eight for the according. Uh, The elk, Roosevelt elk are in lines. They score for the lines that they're in. And the Chinook salmon surrounded. So one point per salmon minimum of three, and then one point per animal that's around a touching adjacent. And you don't count uh, no salmon adjacencies. And then the red-tailed hawk is a uh, three points for line of sight. So scores for each different line of sight between two non-adjacent uh, hawks. So get yourself a little idea on that one. I'm setting usually it comes across the top, but I'm setting it this way because I've got a lot of, you know, left to right space here. So we'll see. What, and then we'll, we'll consider this the dump. So let's get going. Um, I'm, I'm not going to go through the rules. There's a lot of really good tutorials. Once you see how it's played, you'll get the sense. And I'll talk it through to you as well. So um, my big panic here is the fact that I've got to get five points per... Um, habitat so I've got a wow wow okay where do we start well let's start by seeing if we can get some bonus got an eagle there no hmm this is a difficult process to get started on well do I care about the elk well always care about the elk and it's got a good tile this tile can continue the river and the marsh, I guess. And the elk has to come down, so there we go. Two points. This one comes off, so we'll discard over there. These fall. We get a new tile, a new tile, and then we get go into. I've got the bag just off the side here. And if there's ever three of the same, I get the choice to ditch them. If there were four of the same, they automatically ditch. If I have a little acorn here, little acorn, where are we going? Little cute acorn. Um, That gives me some powers to pick and choose things as well. Um, But typically, not tip, yeah, the rule is you pick the tile and the animal together. But of course, in in every game, there's rule breakers, bears. Bears, bears, bears. Now, there's a bear. I could put it there. But this whole habitat thing, right? Now, line of sight. If I put a, if I put a hawk here, it's not really a good line of sight. It needs to go there or down here or down over here. Well, maybe I do put one over there. And then I put a bear there. 
Yeah, I like that. And it's got an acorn symbol on it. So once those eagles come out, and then this goes away, these two fall, two new tiles come out, and rinse and repeat. So I should have some like elevator music going on. Oh, here we have our first opportunity. Ah, you know what? I want that salmon. Now, which one? See, I could take this one, and this one could go here. I could start building on my on my um, planes. I'm, th I'm mispronouncing it, but the yellow tiles. We'll call it the uh, grasslands. Hmm. Or I go for this one, and is there any connect? No, there's no connections there either. Uh, what's my best? I think I'm going to go with this one. Now, already, I know people are screaming. No, you're doing it wrong. I told you I'm going to play this game poorly. <laughs> um, maybe I can, I can have a salmon run that goes one, two, three, four. First acorn. I feel special. Here we go. Dropping these. These two come out. I'm also going to run and gun this because, you know, who knows when you'll be interrupted. Okay, another salmon. I'm going to, I might have to take advantage of that. Now, if I go here, this works. I see that working well there. So I'm going to take this combo. I'm going to put that salmon there. And I'm going to put that tile. Now, the rule is the tile has to go down, but the animal necessarily doesn't, but that's very inefficient. I try not to have that happen, but with these puzzle games, you never know. All right. Come on, where's my birds? Where's the birds? The foxes, and I'm not, I'm not going to sing that song. It's in my head, though. Um, the fox needs pairs of animals, and I have to get 10, is it 10 points for the animals? Man, oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. I got to get two fox. I, yeah, I have to get two fox... You have to get a fox with a couple pairs. Wow. I better get busy here. Um, is that going to work there? This, You know, there's a cool combination of over there. But I can't put that salmon down. The fox. I've got, see, the ha habitable spaces. I have room for, a, a ha um, in this case, a red-tailed hawk. I have room for an elk and a fox. So I've I've these are my two options. I mean, unless I want to use this acorn and and pick there and split from or you can split that whole pear thing up. Hmm. Now this would be very cool over here. Then I could get some Linus, really cool line of sight combos going. I think I might do that. And I'm in a line for my elk. So that works. Oh, do I want to break up that territory? Forest. The best part would have that to be a forest. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let me think about this for once. I said run and gun, didn't I? This ain't run and gun. Okay, so run and gun. Now, yeah, as far as my hawks go, this is, I'll put it this way because it's going to bug me. This has to go here. This goes away. Let's finish this process here. This comes out, and this comes out. Yeah, what you hear are sound effects. All right, route in nature. You hear airplanes every once in a while. Okay, another salmon run, but I got, ah. Uh, 
I've got <laughs> I've got room for bird, and there's a bird there finally. And and I I might have to I just might have to go for that. Bye bye salmon. So this is gonna definitely go here. Get me another acorn. Now where is this gonna go? Do I give up on my mountains and continue? Like, hmm. Now, I could. Wow. I could take care of that requirement of uh, points per animal with the elk and just go for a nice big four run. And I think that's what I'll do. I think that's a spot safe for an elk. So that goes away. That comes down. Yeah, I know. It's a pretty sing-song. Hmm. Not many choices. Well, I definitely have to go for an elk. An elk and what? I've got a forest and a field. Field, forest, field, water. Hmm. Field and water. I'm going to have to spend this to get this, and let's just go for that one. I see a nice spot right there. And I can slide. If I, you know, my map, I can move my map around, but we can still make out what's going on. Okay, so now how this works is if I get it out of sync like that, then they drop like this, then I get rid. I think, I mean, as long as I'm, con if I'm making a mistake, as long as it's a consistent mistake, and then, you know, I'd be playing this like jazz. Please don't hate me for that. I love jazz. Um, Here we go. I've got room. Oh no, this could be dangerous. This oh, good thing I got an acorn. I might have to clear those animals because I need I need hawks and foxes, and I don't see that there. So I'm gonna have to spend that. Now these go back in the bag after I draw four new ones. So I'm gonna one at a time. There's one. Oh no. There's two. Okay, I'm getting safe now. There's three. And four. And these go back in the bag. The only thing that potentially... Say, well, yeah. See, this and this might... Oh, this and this might work beautifully. I'm going to go for this combo here. And if you see what I see... And then we just need a... We just need a salmon there to fix that run and be all happy. Be all happy. All right, this goes away. These drop. Two new ones come out. One, two. Uh, good thing that's there. Yeah, we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to do that. So this has to go there. And I'm seeing potential here with that one. And it's <laughs> working for my map. So, bye-bye, bear. Oh. That goes there. At some point, I'm going to have to do a little kind of sco map scoring update to see what I have to work on. But, I mean, this dictates that as well. Hmm... We might be in danger. Um, yikes. Let's see. Yeah. I don't have any birds that came out. Okay, then. What's the best tile? The best tile is... Hmm. That's a good question. Well, one, two, three, and and what what were my what were my requirements? 
five points. I have to at least five tiles of the same. Three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, forest. I need to start building out my forest. Because my marshes are okay over there. So forest and a mountain would be cool. Forest and a field, forest and a river. It's got to come out here. Hmm. Let's go forest and a field. But also, what are my options here? If I go forest and a river, yeah, I'm going to I'm going to go with this one. See the <laughs> That's the difficult process that goes on in this game. Now, I'm going to have to take this. That can't go anywhere because uh, I kind of scrunched myself when it came to my options. So let's just hope that the draw... See, and this is that randomness that I don't mind, right? It's a, This is mitigatable <laughs> if I play it properly. But Okay, well, see there, I saved myself... I need another fox. So we'll do, we have to do that. Now I've got two pair, which is awesome. I'm going to have to work on the pairings here. Um, I was talking about one, two, three, my forest. If I, go, if I go down here, I'll have to move my map entirely. But I mean, that's okay. Or my water features. I've been working on the water over here. I could I could do that maybe. No. Well, not no. Then I have a bird out of sync. So, you know what? I'm going to come down here and I'll just see if I can move my map a little bit here. There we go. There we there we go. This has to go bye-bye. This comes down. All right, let's 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 get a little more decisions quickly. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to definitely option for the three new. One, two, three in my hand. One, two, three. This goes back in the bag. All right. I can't. Ugh. I'm back to that whole thing. Well, this and this. Because there's, there's a pair. It works because it works together. I kind of ain't myself down the mountains there. Not a good choice on my part. So I got to get a mountain range going again. Mountain range. Where are you going to start, Mr. Mountain Range? Let's start you. And we will. Uh, you know what? It'd be great if you were right there. And then now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow. We need a couple more around that, and then the salmons are figured out. All right. Um, <clears throat> I don't know how well I'm going to do on this ninth level of achievement solo campaign kind of thing. Okay. Okay. I'm in trouble again. <laughs> um, yeah. Ah, see there, ah, there's the rub. Now, I, you know, I could, there's a run of three. You know what? I could do a different run here. I mean, they could go this way. Sure. Sure. That saves me a little bit. So I'm going to go there. This guy will come here. Um... I go something like that. One, two, three, four, five. If I go like that. No, that's not going to work. 
That's crazy talk. All right. Bumping my map around. It's probably bothering you people. It's bothering me. Okay. What am I going to do? I'm so panicked now. Let's put this. Yeah. Let's put this here. Hoping. We're just. Where are there all the birds? Hoping that a bird will come out. All right. That goes away. This is not happening. This is a. This is going to be one of those games where uh, I'm at the mercy. Okay. Dig deep. Booyah. Oh, well, at least I have a pairing. Hmm. And. And, and, and. What am I going to do? Well, I, I mean, I could go another one there with the salmon, but again with the foxes and the birds. Hmm. I, yeah, wow. Wow. Now, I have one, I mean, I have one option. I have one option. And I guess you, I could hear you guys yelling, dude, you got one option. One, two, one, ah, frustrating. Can the guy do this? That might work. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, one, two, three, four. Water, okay, okay. Oh, is this getting painful? I can feel it right, right there. <laughs> no! Uh, well, okay. I'm saved by the cute little orange fox. Well, you know, and then I might as well go here just in case something like a elk comes out. And that can go there. All right, let's push this engine. Come on. I mean, seriously, are there any blue tiles in there? <laughs> oh, I'm good. I might just cry on camera. Okay. Oh, this is painful. This is brutal. Here's a pairing. Do I want any of that, though? That's the question. Um, hmm. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm staring at it so hard to make sure that something happens. Um, and these mountains. I mean, I've got mountains started over there. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is good. This is, yeah, this is nature causing chaos. <laughs> I'm laughing because are there any blue ones in the bag? Well, this works. I can, yeah, this is my only combo. And you know what? Let's make it work like that. And where were we? This has to come down. That goes out. That comes down. Two more tiles. And we have a fox and an elk. Hmm. Well, <laughs> I'm pretty sure at some point birds will come out. I think, maybe. That goes there. I can get an acorn. And, uh, all right. All right. Mountains. Well, 
this looks good up here. Okay, this goes away, this drops down, two more come out. <laughs> there are blue, there's bl there's blue ones in there, trust me, there are. They're just not coming out. Hmm. Well, I have this now. But I'm the only, well, not the only. I mean, I could, I could use the bear in a combination. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Um, marshlands. No marshlands are taken care. Of. So water. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, five. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. One, two, three. So mountains need. And forest needs one. So mountain and forest. So we have mountains available to us. And, 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 and a single bit. Yeah, you know, oh. Hmm, yeah, let's do that. So we're going to spend this. No, we're not going to spend that because I can do that right here. So I'm going to take this bear and we're going to continue the mountains and the bear is going to plop there. This comes out. This comes down. Now, from my understanding, the game ends when you can't pull any tiles to replace any empty. So this is the last turn. And I can't believe no birds came out. No! <laughs> we have one bird that came out this whole game. And I'll show you. I'll sh well, Yeah, so this is actually, I don't think I, I achieved this. But we'll still play it out. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm floored. I'm so floored that, that uh, this is coming apart at the seams. It's awesome, though. It makes for great drama. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four. Oh, we could do this. We could do this. We could do this. We could do that. That comes out. That drops. I can't pull a thing. Game over. Okay. <laughs> Cue the tragic music. Um, so bears, bears score four. Now let's bring this up as a reminder. Uh, group size, so group size of one scores me two points. Group size of two scores me five. Group size of three scores me eight. And also says any shape. So it doesn't have to be a pod of three, but I have no pods of three. So that being said, I have two, four, and five is nine. So I didn't make it there. Because I'm supposed to get 10 points per um, wildlife card. Now, elk. Elk like to be in rows. So there's a row of three for nine. And a row of two for five makes 14. That was successful. We'll put a little check mark there. My salmon. So I get one for each salmon. And then one for each adjacent animal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen points. So, yes, I made more than ten. Oh, my birds. My birds didn't. Uh, I'll finish the wildlife and then I'll show you. There's just, I'll show you. It, it didn't happen. Okay. Fox scores per pair. So here's a fox with a pair of salmon. So that's three points. Here's another fox with a pair of salmon. That's another three for six. Here's a fox with a pair of salmon for uh, another three points. That's nine. And here for elk is 12. Wow. I did not think I would do that for... Okay. Um, 
Let's see where the birds are. That's look. That's ridiculous. There were yeah. Okay. Habitats. So mountains. One two three four five. Check forests. One two three four. Oh, we did. We missed it by one. Um, the agriculture land. One two three four five. The marshes. What? Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. One, two, three, four, five. And the water. One, two, three, four, five. Didn't hit the seven ringer. Um, so outside, I was supposed to get more than 90 points. I'm not even going to total it up because I didn't achieve those uh, criteria for the wildlife and the habitat. So, but that being said, um, this was still a really engaging game, minus the fact that we did, I mean, one, there was one that, one, one, one bird, one, one came out. Oh, and I get one point for my acorn that I got left over, so, but, uh, yeah, um, I'm going to, uh, have a little cry, and then, uh, I'm going to reset the game and play it again but i'm i'm gonna stop uh this session of cascadia it wasn't a successful one but it was successful in the fact that i had fun so thank you so much and uh have fun out there